Madam Tan, Madam Tan Kim Chu. Hello, Madam Tan. I'm Dr. Lim. Where is Dr. D'Souza? I don't want to change doctors. Dr. D'Souza is your surgeon. I am an anaesthetist. But don't worry, we work as a team. It's my job to make sure you are safe during the surgery and are comfortable afterwards. We will be looking after you while Dr. D'Souza is operating. Oh, I see. For your surgery, you may be given a general anaesthetic, which means you will be sleeping throughout the operation. But just before that, I have some questions about your general health. Actually, I am very scared. Is there something you are concerned or afraid of? Can I help to address it? Uh, will I wake up during the surgery? Don't worry, Madam Tan. Modern anesthesia is safe, as our drugs are very reliable and we are guided by a variety of equipment and monitors. We will remain with you while you are asleep to make sure you are safe and comfortable throughout the surgery. So, are you feeling okay to continue? I, I guess so. Are you taking any medications? I am, for my high blood pressure and diabetes. But when I'm feeling okay, I tend to skip my medication. Madam Tan, you must take your medicine regularly. If you do not control your medical conditions, we may need to delay your operation. I see. When you come for surgery, you must have an empty stomach. That means no food or drink for at least six hours before surgery. Why not? If you have a full stomach while under a general anaesthetic, food and liquids from your stomach can rise up to your throat and go down to your lungs. This can lead to serious lung complications. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay, I'll fast for at least six hours. Do you have any loose teeth? Uh, I don't think so. But what have my teeth got to do with my operation? When a general anaesthetic is administered, we have to insert a tube to aid your breathing. Loose teeth may be knocked out in the process. This tooth may then get lodged in the lungs and this will require special equipment to retrieve. Ayo, so scary! Oh, luckily, my teeth are still strong, but a breathing tube in my throat sounds painful. Don't worry. The tube is inserted while you're asleep and is removed before you're fully conscious, so you'll hardly remember it, though you may have a slight sore throat later. If you fall ill in the next few days, please let Dr. D'Souza know by calling his clinic. You might need to have the surgery postponed till you are better. Do you have any other concerns? I heard from my friend that patients can suffer a heart attack or a stroke if you go for surgery. Is this true? Yes, there is a small risk of heart attacks and strokes. Patients with pre-existing medical conditions will be at higher risk and we take extra care to monitor these patients closely during and after the surgery. Although you do have hypertension and diabetes, these appear to be well controlled so I do not anticipate any major problems for your surgery. Let's proceed with the physical examination. Don't worry, Madam Tan. You'll be okay. Madam Tan, I will be giving you the anaesthetic now. Don't worry. Nice deep breaths. I will see you when you wake up. How are you feeling? Is, is the surgery over? 
Yes, you are doing okay. Let me give you a warming light and another blanket. Are you feeling any pain? No. If you feel any pain later, just press this button and this pump will give you painkillers through the drip in your hand. Thank you, Doctor. Have a good rest. Dr. D'Souza and I will check it with you again later.